Hey guys, MJ on here. I just took my pills and I I just realized that I just missed a video 12 hours ago from the SCP Foundation Explained. This is SCP-701, The Hanged King's Tragedy. I already know what this SCP is about, or at least I assume I do because, you know, it's the only one that's named that way. Anyways, let's get into it. You've finally done it. Done After what? years of adding movies and shows to your queues, you've officially run out of things to watch on Netflix. Uh. You've also <laughs> exhausted your entire backlog of books and you've even run out of cereal boxes to read. So you're left roaming the streets in search of entertainment. That's when you- I wouldn't be searching to see straight. I would be searching online. I don't care what's happening. See a worn looking flyer stapled to a nearby telephone pole. It's an ad for a local community theater production of a play you've never heard of. A play called The Hanged King's Tragedy. Normally, you wouldn't think of yourself as much of a theater person. But something about the art on the poster grabs you. There's a strange figure on the poster. Its face yeah, shrouded, its body wrapped in a web of chains. Your curiosity gets the better of you, and you check the performance date. To your pleasant surprise, opening night is a week from now and you don't have anything planned. You've made up your mind. You're going to attend a live performance of The Hanged King's Tragedy. It's going to be the first live play you've ever seen, and Stop. little do you I've seen other live plays. No, it may also be the last. Because The Hanged King's Tragedy isn't just any old play. It's a powerful and deadly it's mimetic not. hazard that may be one of the gateways to an even more dangerous being. It's known to the SCP Foundation as SCP-701, <laughs> so take your seats. I've been tested negative, alright? Be sure to read your programs thoroughly, and prepare for the dark and terrifying tale of the Hanged King. Of course, the guy who tried to go there is watching this video. <laughs> He's smart. It's tragedy, and the wave of death and destruction it causes in its theatrical wake. But how could you know any of this? While you head home to make dinner, looking forward to seeing the new play next week, the local thespians are hard at work performing dress rehearsals. The director, one Marcus Fitch, happened upon a copy of the play, while looking for Carolinian theater that's a little more family-friendly than some of the Shakespearean classics. When he'd first oh, yeah. discovered the hang- Definitely needs to find more family-friendly ones. King's tragedy on a theatrical forum, it was described as being similar to Shakespeare's Hamlet and Titus Andronicus, but the violence was largely offstage and implied, with a lot of the play's nastier elements glossed over, perfect for audience of all ages. Given the fact that performances of The Hang King's Tragedy tend to be mass casualty events, for reasons you'll soon see, the Foundation does everything they can to control the spread of the play's script. All copies are kept in a triple locked vault in a secure Foundation archive, which currently includes two copies of the original publication that are dated to the year 1640, 27 copies of the 1965 trade paperback edition, 10 copies of a 1971 hardcover printing, 21 floppy diskettes containing the play's script, and one SVHS video cassette tape containing a live taping of one particularly infamous incident. However, this seemingly does little to prevent new performances of the Hanged King's tragedy from occurring. The text of the play continually pops up online, often under different or misspelled titles, preventing Foundation web crawlers from keeping track of them all. Nevertheless, the Foundation does everything in its power to detect and stop performances before they can go ahead. That's the danger of putting on or even viewing a performance of the Hang King's tragedy cannot be overstated. It's believed that, in the almost 300 years since its original publication, it's claimed 10,000 lives through performances at the very least. And if you're in attendance, dying quickly is one of the better outcomes. The origins of this mimetic virus are just as mysterious as the power that seems to drive its effects. The play never had a declared author, and the publisher, one William Cook, 
disappeared from all historical records after the play's publications. Performances have been varied over the 300 years the play has been active. It's been spotted everywhere from British university drama troops to American high school plays. In what could have been an even more disastrous tragedy, a television adaptation of the play was almost broadcast by the BBC before the Foundation stepped in and put a stop to it. While its containment classification is currently Euclid, scientists who have studied the play have campaigned strongly to upgrade the Hang King's tragedy to Ketter class yeah, no on kidding. account of its unpredictability and tendency to manifest across the globe with incidences appearing decades apart. While members of the O5 Council are skeptical, some researchers even believe that given a wide enough exposure, the I'm smiling, I'm one of the O5 Council. My cousin gave me the job. Hang King's tragedy could cause a dreaded XK class end of the world scenario. It is that dangerous. At this point, you're probably wondering, what exactly is the Hang King's tragedy? What's the play even about? As the name suggests, the play is a tragedy and takes place over five acts during the Carolinian era, portraying the drama of the royal court much like a number of plays from that time did. It takes place in the city of Serco, the capital of the mysterious fictional kingdom of Trinculo, the focal point of the- Wait, hold on. Sorry, my fault. My headphones unplugged and, uh... Yeah, they're also my microphone. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, he's way too nice. <laughs> I did. I didn't even bother reading the script. <laughs> it's that boring. Mm-hmm. Ah, not another red. I have a razor, an electronic razor. I don't need that.
Yep. Of course, it's the guy from the beginning. See what? Come on, get to the point already. Oh, man. Ugh. Don't remember that part. I just thought that it just causes the people to kill themselves in the theater, not outside. Alright, so that was SCP-701, I, uh, I guess it really does differentiate from the original, <laughs> so, uh, yeah, watch the original in the description, blah blah blah, subscribe, like, blah 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 blah